Hi guys, Luke here from Luke's Tech Reviews. I've got two cases for the iPhone 14 Pro Max to review today. Um, just before I continue, they were sent to me by Michael from Michael's Tech Talk. I'll leave a link for his channel down in the description, but go check him out. He's a great guy with some good videos. So the cases today that he kindly let me are from a company called Banks. Um, and the two cases are, one is the Kevlar case, and the other one is the Mist case. So let's get these unboxed and see what we've got. Okay, so let's start with the Kevlar, which, so as you can see, it's a carbon fiber looking case, very clean, MagSafe inside with a soft touch finish. Feels really nice, quite a sturdy case. Um, so you've got your Banks logo just on the outside here. Just moving down to the bottom, so you've got your cutouts for your speakers and your lightning port. And moving over to this side, this is probably one of my favourite features is, as you can hear by that sound, metal buttons. And metal buttons is the reason why traditionally I rock this official Apple leather case. I love the grip of this case, but the main reason is because of the metal buttons. So the fact that Banks have included metal buttons on this phone case um, makes it feel a bit more premium and metal buttons are so much more clickier than the rubbery ones or the plastic ones that you get. Okay, moving a bit further up, so you got your cutout for your mute switch and that is the outside. As far as how far the bump of the camera hump is raised, um, it looks like you've got quite good protection in terms of the camera bunk in case you dropped it. So if we pop it in my 14 Pro Max space black. There we go. So as you can see, it fits very nicely. As far as grip goes, I feel like it's got quite good grip, actually. I always think that the carbon fiber cases are going to be slippy. But holding it in hand, it's actually quite grippy because the, the edge of it, it's got a really nice soft touch material, but the back of it provides a quite substantial grip okay so that's the Kevlar just to confirm so the so the carbon fiber looking one is the Kevlar one so let's move on to the mist case okay so as you can see it's quite a different take on this case so this is a clear case with a frosted matte finish uh, and as you can see, we've got the MagSafe ring you can see straight through the case. Uh, again, the camera bump, nice and raised, lots of protection around there. As you can see, same style buttons on here, nice metal buttons. Nice. Uh, lanyard cutouts, if any of you want to use a lanyard, you can put one on the phone, on the case. Uh, same cutouts by the looks of it. Uh, again, metal power button and a bit more flex on this one, but it's a TPU case on the back, so it's to be expected. So let's put this one on and see what we're working with. Okay, that one also looks really nice, especially with the space black, it's so well together. Oh, it's tough to decide which one I like more. I'm usually a clear sort of case guy. I think I really like the Kevlar. But this mist is really good for showing off the colour of your phone. I mean, I think it goes so well together. It looks awesome. I don't actually mind the MagSafe ring in the back. I know some people aren't keen. Um, I don't mind. It kind of stands out. It, may, it makes it obvious what sort of phone you've got. Um, so looking at the raised Ivity. Yeah, the camera modules are recessed nicely. Again. Can you hear that? Nice clicky metal buttons. Can't go wrong there. Grip, softer than the Kevlar, but surprisingly for a clear case, quite grippy. You know what it is, guys? It's the sides on the case. They've got this matte, sort of almost leathery style finish on the edges, and it feels pretty awesome. And because they've got that on both cases, it gives the phone a good grip on the side. Um, and the back is it's really nice and smooth doesn't pick up fingerprints which is a really nice touch 
As far as MagSafe goes, I don't have any MagSafe items for you guys to test. If you want to see how strong they are, go check out Michael's channel over at Michael's Tech Talk. As I said earlier, I've left the link in the description down below. Um, and he does a really good test to see how strong the mag magnets are on both variants of the cases. Um, but as far as the cases go from Banks, um, I, I'm, I must say I've, I'm really impressed. I think I'm going to have to purchase... Uh, I'm going to go for the clear one. I thought this one was going to be a favourite. Now this is on. This looks amazing. Feels amazing. Oh, yeah. I think this is my new favourite case, guys. If you're interested in picking one of these cases up, then I'll leave a link in the description down below where you can purchase one. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, drop a comment down below. What case are you currently using? And out of these two, so the Kevlar and the Mist, which one is your favorite? Okay guys, before I go, please remember to like and subscribe and check out the other videos on the channel. And again, please go check out Michael's channel as well. Big thank you to Michael for lending me these cases. Um, but yeah, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.